Check low, relax yourself and let the sugar low Yo, down. It's raining allergy, I'm floating through the Highland Channel swerving. I'm digging on the Sheba, pulling Sheba, she be splurging. We look Hey, what's up, everybody? Uh, it's Gorilla Frilla with something different. Hardcore Search and Destroy. I know you guys never seen that from me. Probably a lot of other people. A lot of people don't play Hardcore Search and Destroy. But, um, now I'm just switching it up a little bit, I guess. Nah, <laughs> but, um, for real though, me and, um, me and, like, this aunt and a couple of my friends, Glenn, we all played Hardcore Search and Destroy one night. And, uh, I got, like, one game like this. It was, like, the, I don't know, one of the better scores I got. I might have got something better, but it was probably boring, more boring or something, so I didn't post it. But, yeah, it's hardcore is cool, but, um, it's just, I don't know, just different. And, um, I just, I, I always prefer core versus hardcore. And then right here, this is a stupid thing. I shot my teammate, and then I get killed for it, which kind of sucks, but it's whatever. What I wanted to talk to you guys about was idea. I know, amazing. An idea I came up with that I thought would be really cool. It'd be for a playlist for Mom One for Two, and what it would be would be it would be um, basically like COD Four. It's made for all the COD Four people, everyone who like misses COD Four or loved COD Four with a passion. Because I know plenty of you guys are out there. Everyone talks about it, but um, what it would be is. For each class slot, you could only have okay. There'd be like five custom classes, right? And it'd be only for this. They'd give you like a five extra custom classes that you can only use in this play mode and play in this game mode. I mean, and um, what it'd be is like for assault, they'd have like M16, AK, maybe M4, since it was in the game. Um, submachine guns, P90, MP5, um, the LMGs. M240, I think, is the same thing as a saw. It might be the M242 or something like that. But it's basically the same thing as a saw. And like the RPD. And then snipers, they can have the Bear 50 and M21. Or maybe Intervention. Since Intervention is the same thing as the R700, it's the same recoil, same idle sway. I'm pretty sure same power. Um, it. It's basically an R700. They changed the look and the sound of the gun just to make it different for this game. But it's basically the same thing. So they could either do that, I guess. And then take out Riot Shield. Secondaries can only be pistols. And then make the perks back to like how they used to have them. So stopping power can be your only red perk. And mm, Yeah, I think they should keep it just stopping power red perk. Because there's no other perk in this game that's like a COD 4 perk. They're all, they're all different. So we can have that, and then, um, for the blue perks, I guess sleight of hand, since it's not, like, game-breaking, it doesn't, like, change the game at all, it just makes it, a uh, your gun a little bit better. Even though it wasn't in COD 4, I think it still could have been in COD 4, and it could have made COD 4 that much greater of a game. Um, yeah, you can have your sleight of hand, your sliding power, secondary, like, steady aim or ninja, since ninja is the same thing as dead silence, basically. And you can't have heartbeat sensors anyway, so it wouldn't help out in that way. But, uh... So basically all those things. And then, maybe just the COD 4 maps. Maybe these maps. I don't know, whatever. But I think it'd be a really fun game mode to play. Just for the people who try hard all the time. They just get, constantly get killed by noob tubes and things. And also, if they put noob tube in, they should make it, um... Take out the first slot, like it did in COD 4. So you can have it like that, and then, um, I don't know, I think it'd be a pretty fun game. I know I'd probably play it, all my friends would play it, because they are some, some COD 4 people. But, um, I think it'd be something entertaining in this game. It'd definitely calm a lot of people down who are just straight hating on this game, even though they play it every day. So all the straight haters can finally shut up, and then everyone else can enjoy the game without them yakking on about how much this game sucks, but... You know, I've never found this game to suck that much. I always thought it was not as good as what they could have made it. Um, basically, it's what you'd expect from a game that had no beta, though. Really, of course it's going to be like this. But, um, you know, it doesn't bother me. This game's still fun to me. I mean, I play it almost every day. I've been playing a little bit less now lately just because I've been ch chilling, chilling like a villain. But, um, 
I actually didn't talk about the gameplay too much. I, like I said, just vector FMJ, sleight of hand, probably cold blooded. Because cold blooded is like the stable perk for. Oh, that was funny. I killed the cold blooded guy right there. Didn't even see him. But um, cold blooded is like the staple perk for search for hardcore. Everyone uses cold blooded. Just since you don't have to have sawing power, everyone can cold blooded hoard it up, and everyone's happy. But. I don't know. I put cold blade on most of my classes anyway, so it's not just because I'm so happy to not have from power on. But um, in hardcore, the vector is actually a really good gun. I'm not one of those people that uses the UMP silenced um in hardcore that much, just because I, I don't know. I just don't like how it feels and everything. It's just different. The vector it shoots fast, has fast reaction time, high rate of fire, so. It's actually a really good gun. If you haven't used it in hardcore, try it out in hardcore. You'll probably love it. But this game's over, so I will see you guys later with my next superior by default. See you guys later. Peace.